often when you're in the middle of things, yes, it's yes. not the right moment. How do you feel about uh, motherhood, Jane? I think for years I, I really didn't, I mean, vi was violently opposed to the idea, actually. thought I had no maternal instincts whatsoever. I was quite terrified, I think, of having um, a, a mentally handicapped child sure. as well. Um, and, um, and it's really only very recently, and I think since being in a, in a relationship where, you know, that's become a possibility, having got married, um, that I've started to think about it as a possibility. Um, but I think, I actually think it's probably one of those things that if you thought about rationally, you would never do. I think it's an Absolutely. emotional thing. Absolutely. So it probably does have to happen by accident. Yes. Oh, well, <laughs> I'm, I'm, not, I'm not sure, because I, I have an overriding return Did there. you? Oh, yes. Yes. Always. Absolutely. Go gooey at prams and things. No, I was never good with that. I don't think that's a return <laughs> marriage. I knew I wanted children, and mm. I knew there would be no doubt that I would think they were the most wonderful thing when I had them. But, yeah. but on the yeah. other hand, I had a terrifically good mother. Um, yeah. What do, would you advise women now, people watching this, who don't perhaps get on with their mother? Because a lot of the things you came to terms mm. and could be honest with your mother yeah. in your 30s, yeah. Helen, you say that a lot of the things you're having now, looking back, this, you know, re you know, retrospective, looking at the, your youth. I mean, I, I think you have to heal it somehow for yourself, and I think that um, it's the most difficult thing to do. And if your mother hasn't been perfect, I, I think you know you, you can't spend the rest of your life trying to make her perfect for you no. if she's not going to be. She's not going to be the mother you wanted. Then you can't do that. But somehow you have to heal it, you have to forgive her or just accept she was the best mother she could be in the circumstances and that nobody can be perfect and when you come around to being a mother yourself, you know, they're going to hate you for something different probably, a whole set of yeah. different complexes. You've got to, you've got to <laughs> accept the situation and come to